Folks at home, folks at home, Mike Iaconelli, we're back where it all started, the tick hole. This is where it started two years ago, going Ike, we're back, we're going incognito, drinking a little bit of Iked Up, and guess what, we got a very special boat today, follow me over here. A canoe, we're going old school. Me and my good buddy John McGraw got the canoe. We got the little handmade dolly by Mr. McGraw. We're going to catch a lot of big bass today. Folks at home, folks at home, come on, let's go. Get a little peninsula up here. Don't be afraid to canoe, folks. Good arm, upper arm strength. Can do in a canoe, folks. Can do. Did some heavy strolling, aka dredging. Keep your eye on the birdie, folks. Keep your eye on the birdie, folks. One of these birdies is about to get hit. Listen to that. There it goes, folks! And it's a big one! Oh! Oh, God, it's a big one! Oh! Oh, my God! Oh! Oh! Oh, look at this thing! Oh, it's a good one! Oh! 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 God. Folks at home. Folks at home. Folks at home. Folks at home, I'm gonna tell you. The trailer hook. What was the term again? Oh. Folks at home, folks at home. Using a trailer hook on your buzz bait in the spring, it's the pre-new deal. The pre-new deal. Use a trailer hook. Come on. Four pounder? Four pounder? <sighs> Buzz baits, grass, bass. What a combination, folks. Hey, folks, if you want more information on how you can capture your fishing like I do on Go and Ike, go to hatcams.com.